Welcome to Interviewing Basics, presented by the Job and Career Education Center at Carnegie Library of Pittsburgh. My name is Rio. The goal of this tutorial is to give you some basic information to help you prepare for an effective and successful job interview. The most important piece of advice for all job interviewees is to prepare yourself. Start by reviewing your resume and cover letter. Make sure that you refresh your memory about what you specifically wrote so that you can answer questions about your qualifications. Research the company. Check out the company website or visit if appropriate. See if the company has a Facebook page or a Twitter feed. If so, follow them. Make sure that you don't go into your interview without any background on the company and what it does. Prepare questions for the interview. In many interviews, you are given a chance to ask questions. Have some prepared so that you don't waste this opportunity to showcase your enthusiasm and preparation. Practice. Come to the JCEC for a mock interview or ask a friend or coworker to help you practice some common interview questions. You should always be on time to an interview. Showing up five to 10 minutes early is a good idea too. While being early is a good idea, don't show up more than 10 minutes early. Some interviewers will find this rude or pushy since they may feel obligated to begin the interview when you arrive. What you wear to an interview is very important. A job interview is a formal business meeting. A suit is a good choice for almost all interviews. Your shirt should be neutral in color. White and blue are especially appropriate. Wear dress shoes. Make sure they are clean and undamaged. Wear only light makeup. Your hair should be neat and away from your face. Avoid playing with your hair during an interview. Jewelry should be small and professional. Avoid wearing cologne or perfume. These can be overwhelming or trigger allergic reactions. If you don't have a suit, you should still wear the nicest clothing you have that is not formal wear. It is never appropriate to wear jeans, shorts, or strappy tops to an interview. It is in your best of interest to avoid t-shirts and anything with a slogan on it. Heavy scents, including soaps, colognes, or other personal care items should be avoided. All of your clothing should be clean and undamaged. There are a few things to bring with you. Bring copies of your resume in case they are needed. Bring paper and pen or pencil so that you can take notes during the interview. Bring anything required or requested by the interviewer. This might include samples of your work or necessary documentation of your education or qualifications. Remember that the interview is a formal meeting. Avoid carrying a large bag with you to an interview. Carry a small purse or portfolio for your documents and personal items. It is not appropriate to bring other people or children to an interview. Try to eat before your interview. It is not appropriate to bring food or drink with you to an interview. Never bring illegal substances or weapons with you to an interview. Interviewing can be nerve-wracking. Here are some tips to help you. Answer all questions honestly. Practicing can help you to phrase things in the best possible way. Be enthusiastic. Don't go overboard, but indicate that the position is interesting to you. Seeming bored or indifferent will suggest to the interviewer that you don't really want the job. Make eye contact. Don't stare, but make regular eye contact. This may be difficult to do, especially if you are shy or nervous. Practice can help you get comfortable answering questions with a smile and eye contact. Be polite to every person you meet. If you meet workers outside of the area you might be working in, remember to be friendly. Everyone in a company is important and being polite and friendly can only help you. Being prepared can help you reduce nervousness and impress the interviewer. Before you arrive at the interview site, silence your phone. It is not appropriate to answer your phone, glance at a text, or check your email in an interview. Your phone should be silent and away for the entire time you are at the interview site. It may be true that the job isn't your dream job. It may be true that you are desperate to find work. However, there are some things you shouldn't say in an interview. Stating that you have to get the job makes you seem desperate and less interested in the specific position. Avoid saying anything negative about your current or most recent position. Negativity will not help you in an interview. 
If you indicate that you don't know about the company or don't really want the job, the interviewer will find someone else who does know or does want the job. Be careful about mentioning other interviews. Be especially careful about indicating that another job opening interests you more than the one for which you are currently interviewing. If you need more help with interviews, the JCEC has services to help you. We offer free mock interviews. A JCEC librarian or staff member will help you practice for your upcoming interview or your general interviewing skills. Call 412-622-3133 for more information. Our Skills for Success speaker series covers a range of topics. Call for more details to see when a relevant speaker is coming. There are a number of services in the Pittsburgh area to help job seekers find appropriate attire for job interviews. The Dress for Success program helps women get interview clothing. Click on their logo to visit their website and learn more. Use these guidelines to prepare for your next interview. Good luck with your job search! If you have questions about this tutorial, please contact the Job and Career Education Center at 412-622-3133 or jcec at carnegielibrary.org. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Please help the Job and Career Education Center by completing a brief survey.